Introduction The primary aim of electrostatics is to find the electric field of a given stationary charge distribution. E and V at any point can be found either by direct integration from Coulomb's law or using Gauss law. The potential V is given by V equal 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 integral 1 by R rho d tau. Electric field E um, potential V um, direct integration, Coulomb's law of direct integration value along with Gauss law of the calculate m. The integration is bit tough. Moreover, in conductors, charge is free to move around and hence rho may not be known in advance. Instead, we may know the total charge of each conductor. Conductor have free charges, free electrons, and free electrons are have freedom to move throughout the conductor. So we charge per unit volume in the so, charge density in the inner car the total charge on the possible idler available at lower value in the world. So, it is better to take the equation in differential form. We have Poisson equation L square V equal to minus 1 by epsilon 0 into rho. If rho equal to 0, the Poisson equation reduces to Laplace equation L square V equal to 0. In Cartesian coordinates, the equation becomes dot square v by dot x square plus dot square v by dot y square plus dot square v by dot z square equal to 0. Laplace equation in one dimension. Here v depends on only one variable x. Then Laplace equation becomes d square v by dx square equal to 0. This is one dimensional add on to the name dot square v by dot x square and add on to our shell. Its solution is given by v equal to mx plus straight line equation. On. We have the equation v equal to mx plus b is the equation of a straight line. The two constants m and b depends on the boundary conditions of the problem. For example, we have two boundary conditions. v equal to 4 at x equal to 1 and v equal to 0 at x equal to 5. For now the condition v equal to 4 at x equal to 1 and the v in the lower term equation 4 and x in 1 and so the equation will be 4 equal to m into 1 plus b. Next condition, v equal to 0 at x equal to 5. v equal to 0 and x into 5 and that is 0 equal to m into 5 plus b. So we have two equation. That means we have two equations and two unknowns. m and v we calculate you know, for that. 1 minus 2 gives, equation 1 minus equation 2 gives, 4 minus 0 equal to m into 1 minus m into 5 plus b minus b. b minus b in the term is 0 at 4. So, 4 equal to m into 1 minus m into 5. m common at the So, it is equal to equation value. m into 1 minus 5 in minus 4m. 4 equal to minus 4m means m equal to minus 1. Substitute in equation 2. m equal to minus 1 and equation 2 to substitute here. That is 0 equal to minus 1 into 5 plus b that is p equal to 5. So, we m into value t, b into value t, v equal to mx plus b in our equation as substitute here. So, v equal to minus x plus 5. v equal to minus x plus 5. See the figure. This figure is x in the number of 1 and that is minus 1 plus 5 or v equal to 4. That is x equal to 1, x equal to 1, v equal to 4. In x in 5, that is minus 5 plus 5 will be 0. So, when x equal to 5, v equal to 0. Conclusion. v of x is the average of v of x plus a and v of x minus a for any value of a. v of x in the world is the average of v of x plus a and v of x minus a. A is the value in the world. This is a one-dimensional case. We can simply write one slot and write another one. So, this is the case of two-dimensional and three-dimensional. It's a complicated case. That is, v equal to 1 by 2 into v of x plus a and v of x minus a. So, that is v equal to 1 by 2 into v of x plus a plus v of x minus a. Let us check this. x equal to 2, a equal to 1. m equal to minus 1, b equal to 5. We can write the equation as well. Equation with the lens of studio. By m equal to minus one, b equal to five and the other v equal to mx plus b is substituted. I'm already kitty v equal to minus x plus five. That is v of x equal to minus x plus five.
This is x in 2 and substitute a. That is v equal to minus 2 plus 5, which is equal to 3. For v of x in the value 3 and all. Here, what is x plus a? x plus a and 2 plus 1 equal to 3. x minus a and 2 minus 1 equal to 1. v of x plus a and all, v of 3. x in minus x in 3 and all. That is minus 3 plus 5 equal to 2. V of x minus a on x in x minus a value 1 node that is minus 1 plus 5 equal to 4. Then the average 2 plus 4 by is equal to 3. Now we can do this. V of x in the value of v of x plus a and v of x minus a and average it. Now we can do this. Laplace equation does not allow local maxima or minima. Extreme values of V must occur at end points. Laplace equation local maximum local minima allow jayla. extreme values that means maxima or minima that will be only allowed on end points. If there were a local maximum, V would be greater at that point than on either side. If there a particular local maximum, like a local maximum V that will be greater, higher value than on either side. And therefore, could not be average. V of x equal to v of x plus a plus v of x minus a by 2 in the averaging concept work out. So, Laplace equation does not allow local maxima or minima. Laplace equation in two dimensions. If v depends on two variables, Laplace equation becomes dot square v by dot x square plus dot square v by dot y square equal to 0. This is not an ordinary differential equation. It is a partial differential equation. So, we cannot write a general solution that contains just two arbitrary constants. Now, the one dimensional area is the arbitrary constant equation. V of x equal to mx plus b in the equations. This is the solution possible. Consider an irregular surface with respect to a horizontal flat surface. One irregular surface in the consider with respect to a horizontal flat surface. So, in the plane, a horizontal flat surface and that is extended to the irregular surface. Imagine a circle of radius r about the point x, y, then the average value of v on the circle is given by v equal to 1 by 2 pi r integral v dx. So, we will see x, y in the point and x, y in the point. Then right the number circle assume here the circle has a radius capital R. And then the potential equation will be like this. We DL and or in the length element and number you say that one to the average equity number circumference of the circle you say. The equation gives the average value of potential V has no local maxima or minima. We have to say that 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 means no hills or valleys on the surface within the boundary. Laplace equation in three dimension. Laplace equation in three dimension is given by dot square v by dot x square plus dot square v by dot y square plus dot square v by dot z square equal to zero. But the number sphere and number consider the sphere and radius capital R on the length of the two dimensional length of the length of the length of the length the value of v at the center is given by the average value of v over a spherical surface of radius r. That is v equal to 1 by 4 pi r square closed integral over the sphere v dA. But the area element dA is the length of the surface area of the sphere 1 by 4 pi r square on the view. We can have no local maxima or minima. Here we have potential local minima or maxima possible. Extreme values must occur at the boundaries. 